COVID-19 continues to impact the South Plains and with winter months approaching, many will be spending more time indoors. KLBK's Olivia Whitehead spoke to experts today on how this could make you more susceptible to the virus. Avoiding the cold this winter means staying inside, which also means there's not much air going around. The smaller environment you're in, the more air you're going to share. The longer you're with somebody, the more air you're going to share. So if that person or you is spitting out viral particles, you have a better chance of ingesting enough to get sick. Factors Dr. Craig Barker from UMC says comes with spending less time outside. We don't have that West Texas wind blowing particles away from us, so you're going to share air with anybody when you're indoors. Which is why UMC Director of Infection and Prevention Renee Yates stresses prioritizing health practices even more. If we drop any of the precautions that we're taking currently, that will only elevate the risk. Now, aside from staying six feet apart with more people indoors, it's important to maintain those minor precautions, such as washing your hands, cleaning off surfaces, and masking up, especially during flu season. A person with a mask on who's sick is going to kick out less viral particles outside of that range in their area. And although the masks aren't going to completely filter the flu coming in, they do filter some of it. So you decrease that inoculum or that viral load that you're getting from someone near, near you. Which is why it's also important to get vaccinated. A lot of people, and I've heard it um, being said that, well, since I'm wearing a mask anyway, I'm not going to get a flu shot. But this is not the year that you want to move away from that good practice. Olivia Whitehead, KLBK News.